Hello, and welcome to the Game Dev Quickie. In this project series we are making a memory game. We have finished the game loop and scoring system already. The main task for this episode is to create a card flipping animation. The animation will have two parts. First we shrink the card, change the texture, and then expand the card back. Let's continue coding. We start by modifying the card. Add a position origin, and use it when calculating the bounding rectangle. We change the flipped field into a public property for convenience. Another variable we need is the size scale. We don't need a method to get the flip state anymore. Initialize the origin as the middle of the texture. And set the scale to 1. Adjust the draw method using the origin and scale. Let's move to the board class now. We need to fix the board spacing. The card's position is at the center now instead of the top left corner. A little fix, and let's check that everything still works. Good. We can work on the animation now. Flip time is the duration of the animation. Flipping is a flag of an ongoing animation. And flipping direction tells if the card is shrinking or expanding. Let's prepare an easy method to reset the card. And use it in the constructor as well. Next we modify the flip method to start the animation. And lastly, the update method. If the card is flipping, we adjust the time left. Then set the scale proportionally. When the first part of the animation is complete, we change the direction and switch the texture. When the second part finishes, we stop the animation. Back in the board class, when picking a card we skip the flipping one. And simplify the reset. We also need to add the update method. One last thing we need to do is to call the update from every state. And here we go. A nice card flipping animation. Perfect. Let me know how you liked this episode. You can find the code in the description. Do you have any suggestions on how to improve the game? Please, share them in the comments. We will continue working on this project in the future, don't miss it. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.